In this video, we'll show you a proof of concept of an attack on a serverless system, that demonstrates how dangerous the implementation of bad code could be. In this example, we'll show a lambda function granted with high permissions. This lambda function was originally developed to stop an Amazon EC2 instance. After passing the instance name as an input, the instance is stopped. Since the code is not well developed and doesn't filter the input correctly, it's possible to inject a command after the instance name using a command input for semicolon. This will instruct the code to interpret the next input as a command. A simple and harmless command is run as a proof of concept. This shows that the injection is successful and that the command has been interpreted. Let's do something more elaborate now. Changing the lambda function timeout from the inside. Here, we can see that the function timeout is originally set at 2 minutes. A total of 6 commands will be run. We will download, unpack, and install the AWS CLI tool. We will also check the roles and the policies, and finally, modify the function timeout. Without the use of a proper content delivery network like Amazon CloudFront, or a third-party security tool like Trend Micro Application Security, the input is not verified or filtered. Consequently, a malicious actor can see the command line tools, that the page uses via simple querying. We then inject a shell command, that downloads and installs the AWS CLI tool. As a proof of concept, the CLI tool changes the function timeout to the maximum duration. From 2 minutes it is changed to 15 minutes. After the function timeout is changed, an attacker can perform other malicious activities, such as privilege escalation, or data exfiltration. To learn more about security considerations in serverless environments, visit www.trendmicro.com and read our research paper, Securing Weak Points in Serverless Architectures, Risks and Recommendations.